Welcome to the, this episode of Tech Talk with Ryan for your unique Typhoon Q500 4K. Today we're going to talk about the 4K features and how it's all adjusted through the camera. The first feature we'd like to talk about is the settings feature. In the lower right hand corner you'll see a gear. Tap that. OK the warning. And you can see that we have different settings here. We're going to start with the video settings. Video settings include Ultra HD up to 30 frames per second. We also have a full H Ultra HD which is at 25 and 24 frames per second. As we go down we can see 2560 by 1440s and then into our normal HD. We have slow motion video at 120 frames per second, 60 frames per second, 50, 48 and the list goes on 30 down to 24 frames per second. The next setting you'll see is the audio switch. This is default to the off position. Simply press the switch and you can turn the audio on. In the photo mode setting, you can see that it'll shoot in JPEG for the normal user or DNG, which is a RAW format for the more advanced users. The image style settings allow you to change from natural, gorgeous, raw, or night. And this is a, a basic format, so if you want highlighted colors, you go with the gorgeous. If you want just the straight raw footage, you go raw. If you're planning on flying at night, select night. Back on the main screen, you can see here, over on the right hand side, a video and still switch. What this does, it allows you to shoot video and take pictures or a still off the video with the camera button or you can switch to simply the stills button. This will increase the resolution and also increase the size of the pictures. Both in video and camera mode you have adjustable white balances, auto white balances, and exposure settings and ISO settings. So for instance, say you want to just shoot in auto, you can select auto and everything will operate as it would any normal camera. What you can do then is you could actually hit the white balance manual mode and you could actually adjust your ISOs and your shutter speed. In auto white balance mode you'll have options to select sunny, cloudy, fluorescent, incandescent, and sunset or sun sunrise. Other than the software changes, you notice the camera's overall look is much different. Uh, included is a replaceable ND filter on the front. So say your camera gets scratched, you could simply twist the lock and pull the filter off. This concludes the new features of the 4K camera. Please like our videos and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Happy flying guys.